Hi everyone and welcome to another training video from the technology training department at the conference. In this training video we're looking at OneDrive and freeing up hard drive space on your computer as you begin to accumulate data and use more hard drive space. Let's begin. All we will want to do is initially open your OneDrive folder. So I'm going to click File Explorer and over to the left hand side I'll click OneDrive dash TN District Attorneys. This is where my files are located to view the available space on your existing hard drive. Click this PC. That will give you just a topical overview. As you see this get closer and move the bar move to the right side when it gets around 10% the bar collar will be red and that will indicate that you are using a lot of hard drive space and your drive is almost completely filled up. So what you want to do as you begin to use OneDrive is you have the capability to free up hard drive space from your computer which will then take your files and store them in the cloud until you decide to double click or re-download the file. This is good practice to use especially as you accumulate videos, large files, etc. and just good practice to always keep your hard drive as free and at giving it as much storage space as possible. With OneDrive you have multiple options but one of the most notable one will just be to free up space. You can see the folder names that are indicated here. There's a column called status that lets you know whether the files are stored in the cloud which you will need internet connectivity in order to access so if you ever see the cloud as your status that means you will need internet connectivity in order to open and then download that file. So for all the folders they are all stored in the cloud and for this file it has a green check mark. What that means is that file is local and locally stored on my hard drive. This is a large file. You can see it's 5.246 gigabytes and if I wanted to free up the space on my computer. I can simply right click on the file and then left click free up space. I will point out if you are traveling and you have a need to work remotely etc where you will not have internet connectivity you will want to make sure that that file is always stored on your device. In order to do that simply right click then left click always keep on this device. And what happens is there's a certain period of time that if you do not open the file the automated software will detect that the file has not been open for a certain amount of time. It will then automatically upload and keep the file solely in the cloud. Well the file will actually be in the cloud synchronized with your computer but after a certain period of time if you do not open the file it will then be stored via the cloud only and in order to access the file you would need internet connectivity in order to download that file again. So in this case say we want to free up 5.2 gigabytes of hard drive space right click left click free up space that will initiate a process change. It will resynchronize, and after a certain period of time, it will then show that this file, the status will be a cloud, meaning that it is available from the portal only, which I will be able to view just the image of it right here. However, in order to actually use it, I will double click it and it will then proceed to download the entire file so that I can open that file. In this case we are currently using File Explorer 
in order to view the file. You will also be able to view the file through the portal. In order to do that, we'll want to open our web browser. I'm going to open Microsoft Edge. Once the browser launches, and we will sign into the portal. There is quite a bit of activity going on. Okay, OneDrive has updated. That file should be shown. Yes, we do see the cloud. Okay, very good message. Just about what occurred. Do you see the cloud status is a cloud, so that means that that file is available online only. Go back, we'll go to the portal, sign back into office.com, click OneDrive. You will not have to do this, but this is just to show you through through the portal and your browser that that is available and you will just simply be using file explorer in order to access and manage the data the content etc that's on your hard drive well this completes our video training on onedrive and freeing up hard drive space on your computer thanks for watching